All right, we're at Tractor Supply. Why am I here? Uh, I wanted to get a look at some of the trailers. So I'm looking at uh, how to actually get stuff done, especially with uh, pickups being the price they are. There's got to be other options. Uh, do you get a pickup? Do you get just something that can fall with the damage on that brand new one? Or, or what do you do? There's a lot of factors that go into uh, making a decision. You've got to come up with what the best idea for you is. I see if I can see in this one. This is right. Feel really like construction flip down door. It's got the little uh, tab on it that flips out, so you got a ramp. It's got tie down hooks. And it's not bad. I like the double axle. Oh, they got the. Uh, Lock on the wheels, you can't drive away like you got a parking ticket. Most of power brakes. Uh, a little cheaper options, although cheap wouldn't really be the what I'd call them. Single axle. Some nice interior, a little more of an arch to it. Same thing, once the ramp flips down. That on hooks or ramp flips down plus the little tongue. A lot of them uh, don't have that little tongue on there. Single axle. Back to the price, six by twelve. Yeah, only one hundred nine a month. Yeah, they don't like that interest. Uh, a lot of times, this is a little more the option though. You can use a uh, open trailer. I mean, twelve hundred. It seems like a thousand is uh, pretty much your bottom of the trailer market. Oh, but look at the size and the wheels on that one. For 1200, and this one's a thousand. Wheels half the size. Maybe got a deck board broken. Spare tire carrier, but no spare tire. Five by eight with four. Similar. And those tires are just so small. I just think about how many times a tire's got to turn go the same distance your truck tire as it's pulling it or whatever car and how long are those bearings gonna last I mean bearings last a long time but just it's turning so much and that's gonna be I don't know you just think about it because you see somebody along the side of the road 2500 look how that more than doubles and size doesn't go up that much so if you're getting a trailer you definitely want to figure out how big you need and the wood is going to eventually rot out. Well, I guess metal is going to eventually rust too. So if you can keep it dry, it's even better. Oh, looks like a metal fender on the left and uh, some kind of plastic with little toolboxes. All right, let's see if we can see what this is. No, just like a tiny little toolbox. I don't know if you could throw a couple straps in there or something. Like it's adorable. Uh, double axle wood deck. $36.99. They jump up fast. 6.3 by 14. Looks like that's the same thing. So this is a tractor supply has. Uh, maybe not the uh, end all be all. It gives you an idea of what uh, modern new trailers are. Um, there are other places to carry the new ones, but as far as a like a franchise or something that's everywhere. Uh, my experience, this is uh, pretty average, I guess, for price point. Um, when I've actually bought trailers, though, typically I have found them at a smaller dealer, like a one-off, you know, like a one-off location. Uh, as far as new trailers, that's going to give a little better deal. But uh, that is Factor Supply trailer selection.